Well, why might a toggle clamp be used to hold an object in place versus using screws or glue? I thought that with the toggle clamp, you get this handle that allows you to easily turn it on or off. What's the like the proper term? Like apply pressure and eliminate the pressure. Yeah, engage or disengage an object. Excellent. Yeah. Yeah, it comes down to uh, speed and convenience, I think. Yeah, a, a screw, you're going to need to use a tool, a screwdriver, and spend, you know, I don't know, 30 seconds unscrewing a tool, uh, unscrewing the screw. Glue is fickle anyway. I don't like glue, but if you use it correctly, it's more or less permanent, so you can't get anything uh, apart. Uh, and if it's an application in which you want to be able to remove parts, then um, obviously glue is not a great use uh, for that application. So yeah, toggle clamps uh, doesn't require any tools, just your hand, easy to engage and disengage parts. Um, let's see, what positional adjustability of the clamp is built into a toggle clamp and how, uh, uh, how do you alter it as needed? Could you elaborate what you meant by positional adjustability? Sure, yeah, great question. So let's say that um, I've got you know, a, a surface like this, my hand. And I've got the toggle clamp mounted right here. And then can you hold this pen and like put it between the rubber stop and my, my hand? Yeah, so right, let's say that I, I've clamped this, uh, this pencil in place like that. And, but, but, and also consider that this surface right here, the mounting surface, that's fixed. That does not move at all. But so what if... More like, like that? Sure, that's fine. What if we find that oh, the toggle clamp is not quite holding that pencil in place? Maybe it, it, it's you know uh, it comes down like this, and there's this gap. What what can we adjust? This right? Yep, that's right. Yeah, that's. I never noticed that before. So that exists there. You can turn it. That's right. Yep. That that'll move this rubber stop. You know, up or down as needed. What is this called? Uh, this is just a threaded stud. That's it. Okay, and uh, why might someone use a toggle clamp to hold something down versus just putting a heavy weight on it? Uh, I hypothesize that because the toggle clamp is smaller than a... I mean, you're looking for pressure to keep something in place. And pressure can equate to like a large mass on top of it. Imagine like a big stone to hold like a... A sheet of paper in place but or you can use this right you can just or you can use this and it's smaller in dimensions and it could just apply as much pressure I think yeah I think that's a big one just the the footprint of this toggle clamp is so much smaller and you can apply just as much pressure as you would with a big weight but using a much smaller footprint okay. if you found this content helpful Consider enrolling in our signature program at mypipelineacademy.com. Whether you're an individual interested in beginning a new career as a mechanical designer or a company interested in training your new engineering hires, our signature program helps students develop the practical skills they need to be productive mechanical design engineers. Seating is limited. We hope to see you there soon.